are not together right now, but we will be seeing each other at practice if we have it. But today we will be doing a back to school, like clothing and what we've gotten for school video. So we will be showing you what we've gotten for school as in clothing, book bags, lunchbox, school supplies, and shoes. And that's what we will be showing you in this video. So I will see y'all whenever I have like my first outfit on and then I will like show y'all what it looks like on me and I will show y'all my shoes with that outfit like what goes with that outfit so I will see y'all whenever I have my outfit picked out that I'm going to show y'all first and bye I'll see y'all whenever I'm ready what's up everybody so today me and Abby are going to be doing a back to school video sorry I look like trash on Wednesdays I don't really try because we have practice so like yeah, but, so what we're going to be doing is showing y'all our book bags and, like, everything in them. And then our clothes. So, I haven't got my shoes yet, so put that there. Um, I got one pair of shoes. Like, I've had them, but I haven't worn them but, like, twice because they were four back to school. Because, but they were having, like, a sale, so, like, the fam couldn't pass up the sale. So, yeah, but I'm getting, I'll, hmm, I don't feel like inserting anything. But, yeah, they're just the yellow old school vans. I believe I have black old school vans that are, like, super, sorry, that's a cat toy. Oh, my gosh, it's so loud. All right, well, I guess I'll just show you all my book bag from last year was this Nike one. And... It did not hold up, like, at all. It's, like, ripping all inside. Like, the outside held up pretty well. Okay, well, that thing's making too much noise. But I had old school vans somewhere. But, yeah, so I'll do the clothes first. So I'll go ahead and try on the clothes. So the first outfit I have is just this striped shirt. It has yellow and, like, a red, like, maroon color on it. And it is, like... It has like ties right here. I got this shirt from Kohl's and then I have just these like light jeans with it. And they're, they're just like plain light jeans. They look like this. And then I got my jeans from Hollister. That's where I get my jeans from. And then I get my, I've gotten my shirts from a few places, but I will let y'all know like what, like where I got my clothing and like from what store and like that's like the details that I will have like about my clothing that I have for back to school. And then I will show you on my next outfit in the next clip. Bye. So this is the first outfit. It'll be tucked in a little bit better. But and by the way, I'll go ahead and tell you this. Everything's from Old Navy because, because. Um, so first is just this loose tee that says ice cream sandwich. It's pretty, um, Like, it's not a normal saying that'd be on a shirt, but I thought it was cute, and it's just plain white, and then it has, like, a yellow out, a yellow collar, and yeah, writing's yellow, and then it's just these jeans, they have, like, a hole here, both the knees, and then at the bottom, they're super skinny, Ugh. at the bottom, they're just, like, ripped, and then they have, like, holes, and with this one, this is my first day of school outfit, but, um, with this one, I'll either be wearing my clean vans or my yellow vans. So, yeah, this is the first outfit. So, this is another, like, shirt that I got. I have way more shirts than I do jeans because, like, I already had jeans from last year that I got from Air Apostle and stuff. And so, these, this, I'm going to show y'all, like, these two outfits because they both are, like, in this, they have the same jeans. There's just different shirts that are for the jeans. And then those are, they're the same jeans that I had on last time. They're the light jeans. And then the shirt that I have is just this plain black Adidas shirt. And it is from Foot Locker, I think so, or Hibbit Sports. But yeah, that's this outfit. It's just a plain shirt. It just has nothing on it. So yeah, um, it was around like $25 if y'all wanted to know just to like go get it. But I will see y'all again 
with my other outfit on. Bye. Okay, I gave up and took my necklace off because it was bothering me, and I can't get this shirt to tuck the way I want it to tuck. But, so, it's just this, like, striped shirt that has, like, ruffles at the bottom, like, the neck and sleeve, and I don't even know what colors it has on it, but it's just striped. And then, um, and by the way, under all of this, I have a white tank top. This one I tucked in, because, like, all the shirts that I tuck in, I tuck in the tank top. Um, but so then it's just these plain jeans, like, no holes, but the bot oh, and they're high-waisted, by the way. And then the bottom just has, like, fade, and then it has, like, it's distressed at the end. So that's my second day of school outfit. And yes, if you, this is for me every year, but I get really excited to go back to school. So I plan everything out. So, yeah. This is second day squat. Okay, so I'm back with my third outfit on, and it's just this like blue and white striped shirt, and it has this little bow tie at the bottom of it, and it has like a little hole in its tie at the bottom. But I have it with just like plain black jeans, and I rolled my jeans up at the bottom, and I rolled these ones up because they're a little long, but I'd recommend getting this shirt. It's really like nice and just like playing for back to school, especially if you go to middle school so you won't get dress coded. So I'll see y'all with my first outfit on in the next clip. Bye. Okay, so this is the next outfit. And by the way, from here on out, I didn't plan anything. So I'm just like throwing pieces together. But this is piece did go together because this is an extra large and that's not my size. But it's just a long, big baggy shirt because I'll get dress coded if it's not past my butt. So and then it's just leggings, you know, every basic white girl's go-to. And, yeah, so. But I did get new leggings this year, though, because your girl goes through some leggings, so. Okay, so I'm back, and the next outfit I have is just these plain, like, dark jeans. And they're also from Hollister. Again, my all my jeans are for Hollister, except for my ones last year that I could be wearing. And then... The shirt I have is like this mustard yellow kind of just dress kind of shirt. And that's my fourth outfit, I'm pretty sure. Whatever outfit it is, the shirt is also from Kohl's. And then my next outfit will be with like probably the same jeans again because I have a lot more shirts than I do jeans and I can wear the ones from last year. But these jeans are just the plain dark ones that I can be wearing with several outfits that I have. So, thank you, and I will be back with another. So, this is the next outfit. It is just high-waisted, light-colored jeans that have a hole, like, here, here, and here. But, um, for everybody that goes to our school and is like, Pat's dress code, it's not. Trust me, I got index cards for back to school, and I made sure I was not going to get dress coded by our teachers so again i wouldn't normally have this in but i want to show you it was high waisted i just cuffed the bottoms and there's two shirts with these jeans so yeah so this jeans just yellow and has a pink collar white sleeves so this is the first shirt with these jeans and i will show y'all oh and these are the shoes that i got for like pe this year i thought they were super cute but I mean, I don't know. They're just white Nikes, and they have, like, it feels like embroidery, but it's, like, just colored here. Um, honestly, I don't think I bought an outfit that would go, because, like, that wouldn't go. I mean, I don't know. Don't come for me. I actually do have an outfit that would look really good with these, which I guess I'll show you. So, yeah, this is the first shirt. Back. And the next outfit I have is just the dark jeans that I had on in last clip that you saw of my last outfit next shirt i have is just this champion shirt it's navy blue red that's what's usually in their logo is the red and then i have the gray shirt and this shirt is from hibbit sports for sure and i just got it as we went to the mall and then i will see you in the next clip because this outfit doesn't have really much of a saying or anything but this is just my fifth outfit and i will be back with another one in the next clip. Bye. All right, this is the second shirt. I'm not sure if it would be with these jeans, but I have a lot of jeans, so yeah, but it's just this black shirt and it says just, what does it even say? Just a girl who loves a sauce and 
Yes, the sloths are my favorite animals. So, this is a cute order that my aunt got me, I believe. But it's super cute. Basic tee. So, this is the last outfit that's coming okay, up. So, this is the next shirt, well, like, outfit with the, like, imprinted Hollister jeans. I have this shirt and then my other one that's in our previous videos that just has, like, the pink writing and everything on the back of it. But I'm not going to show the next, like, outfit because it's just the shirt that I had, like, on in one of our last videos. So, I'm not really going to show that clip. But I just decided to put on this outfit with the jeans. But this shirt has the same, like, jeans, like, with it because, like I said, I did not have as many jeans as I did shirt. So, I will see y'all in, like, the next clip of my me showing you my book bag bye so by the way this video will probably be one of our longer videos because this is just my part and abby's part is either next or it's been going on so just know that i'll probably do my part and then hers or hers than mine you know so yeah this is my book bag because i got a new one this one has to last me like eighth grade in high school they said so I got a a I don't want to say adultish but like more I don't know I just got a book bag that I thought I would like for that many years and this is just a chance for a book bag and the print is just a light pale pink with like leaves on it I don't know this is a trend right now so first I'll just start with the outside of the book bag. So I did get a pale pink water bottle, but I left it at Abby's house. So on this side pocket, I just have a clip and I stain everything. So I have a Tide pin to go. I'm not sure if we're allowed to have those in school, but I'm bringing one anyways. And then on this pocket right here, I have two keychains. I have like a little owl keychain that my nanny got me. And she's really, she was really sick and passed away. And then I have this guardian angel that my mom got me. So yeah, I think I'm gonna move y'all down or hang on, I'll just get my chair because I literally don't like that y'all can't see me. So this is my chair, yes. The seat's not painted because we were gonna put a cushion on it. It's a long story. So this is my book bag, like I said. Um, I'm just gonna set it right here. So, in this front pocket, I have a pale pink hole puncher because this was, like, from years ago. I thought it was a stapler, but now that I'm looking at it, it's the hole puncher. So, I probably will actually take this out because I don't need a one-hole hole puncher. And then I have these. This one's stained. I have pink. What are these called? Sticky notes. I just put that. And then I have a bunch of these like things that you put in your notebook and you can write and stuff. And I just have orange, yellow, green, and pink. And then I have two packs of index cards. So that's that in the front pocket. And it's very hard to get stuff in here because there is like, Okay, so that's this pocket. So the front pocket's done. And then the pocket that has my keychains on, key on it has a vanilla coconut hand sanitizer. It's actually a foam hand sanitizer. Um, I just thought this one would be easier for school because I know this one won't leak because, here, yeah, I'll just use it for you. It's like a foam hand sanitizer so it's foam and then you just keep rubbing and it becomes hand sanitizer now I have to use that because um and you don't really need a lot of this stuff because it's very strong in scent now everything in my backpack's gonna smell like vanilla coconut I think that's the scent and it's very true to its scent so yeah that's that and then I have a calculator I like using my own calculator better than the school's calculator because I'm not a very big germ person. So, yeah, just a regular calculator. And then last but not least, I have my pencil pouch. 
So my pencil pouch this year is, I believe, it's not like a name brand or anything. Um, it was in the Brandy Melville section at Staples, but, so because she had a bunch of pencil pouches, but then we walked somewhere else, and it wasn't Brandy Melville, but I'm okay with that because that's cute. So it has little flowers on it. I believe they're called daisies, and then it's just pale pink and gold. And so in the top zipper, I have things like highlighters, um, a glue stick, cap erasers. I have these scissors because I use big scissors, but um, last year, it, like the scissors went through my pencil pouch, so I got ones with cap this year. And then I have markers, the skinny ones, and then just colored pencils down here. So that's in the top one. And then down here in this bottom one, I have a big eraser from last year because I did not need a new one just because this one I literally used like four times last year. And then I just have this high, this lead pencil that I used last year and it's just a tiny one. And then I have five um, lead pencils to start me off with. And then I have three black pens because our school, I mean, this year did not request us to have um, blue pens. Last year they did, but I'm going into seventh grade this year, by the way. And yeah, so that's in there. And this pocket will also have my um, phone in it. So then right here, I just have this like, girl pack I guess and it just has things like personal things and then just like hand sanitizer and then this little squishy I don't know why that squishy's in there but it is and then other things that like I might need throughout the year and I just zipped up something and it broke my zipper wow a tragic Presley tragic of course that would happen to me and watch it's probably not gonna zip now Okay, it will. Never mind, I didn't break it. And that fits perfectly in this pocket right here. And then in the first big pocket, it has my binder for this year. And I chose orange, don't know why I liked that color. And then it just has dividers and paper in it. And it's just a one inch binder. And then I have the divider like sheet things that these little things come out when you put them in the dividers and then I just have this notebook that I didn't use last year so I decided to keep it and it's just a cute notebook like that and then last on the paper last year it said I would get Spanish again so I'm just keeping my Spanish to Eng English to Spanish dictionary so yeah second biggest pocket or should I say the first one if you start from up here I just have so I made I think this does my school hang on yeah it does well um I'll just tell y'all I made I think this just says my name and y'all already know that so yes nope it says my middle school as well but I made beta club you know just gonna so I made Beta Club, um, and I don't know exactly what to do with that. I made Beta Club last year, but I did. I forgot to bring twenty dollars, to be honest. So, yeah. Um, and then I'm not going to go into very much depth of this, but I just have matching folder and notebook for every class, except my math class, which I think is blue, has a blue and orange folder because you know, go Florida Gators. That's who I want to play softball with. But yeah, so that's my book bag. Sorry if this video was entirely too long. That's all I have to say to that. But yeah, and also I keep things, I don't want to show you this because that's pretty nasty, but my brush and like deodorant and stuff like that, but clearly it's not school time yet, so I need that stuff. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I don't know if this I'll be the end or Abby will be the end, but yeah. 
this is my part. The next thing that I'll be showing y'all is like the shoes that I got. I got a pair of like Air Max or whatever, and then my Vans. So the Vans that I got, I just got these like black slip-ons because like I have gray checkered and all that. And then for my like, Nikes for like my tennis shoes, I got these like black Air Max, the 270s. And then that's the shoes I got because I still have like um, Air Force from last year. And then I also have um, still my Vans from last year. And I have my Crocs and Birkenstocks and all that from last year. And then, like, that's all I have for my shoes and stuff. But the next thing I'll show y'all is, like, my book bag and, like, lunchbox and water bottle and, like, supplies that I got. So, I'll see y'all in that. I am going to show y'all my lunch bag, book bag, water bottle, and supplies. I got Under Armour stuff. So, I just got this black, like, kind of boyish or whatever lunchbox, just black and white. It has, it's, like, one of the thermal ones. So, it, like, keeps your stuff cooled down and stuff. So, it's, it's blue on the inside because, like, it's the thermal. So it just looks like that and it has like the pocket for whatever you need and then it also has another pocket that i'll show you and it has it just like right here just to keep like whatever you want in there probably like you can keep your phone or whatever you wanted in there but then i have my water bottle it like keeps stuff warm too it's the tsl one and it like keeps your stuff cool it's just like a floral kind of pattern and it's just a screw off lid it's steel so that it will keep your stuff cool or like whatever it is that keeps your stuff cool so then i have my like purple and like neon whatever book bag and my first pocket i just have like index cards because like and headphones because i needed index cards and headphones so that's just like this little small pouch right here and then i have this pouch at the bottom that i don't really want to use because like stuff can get smashed down there but then I have my second smallest pocket, and then I just have like my pencil case in it. And then I got, I'm not carrying binders this year except for one for Spanish because like I really don't want to carry those. I just have this extra little thing. So I got like an a ruler, and then I got like extra stuff for like my classes. I just got like colored folders and like notebooks for each of my class because I didn't want to carry around binders. So I just got like a colored folder and um, a notebook for each class. And I got an extra one just in case I ran out of them. But then I also got my binder with like the um, dividers in it. And it just has paper and stuff in it until like I need what I have to do in it in school. And that's really all I have in my book bag except for like a calculator, a, um, protractor and scissors and stuff i got these lead pencils colored pencils markers and just like erasers and stuff like that but that's what i have in my bag and that's all that i will be showing y'all in this video so i hope that helps you get a better idea on what i got for school hope that it helped you and this is the end of the video bye